Welcome guys to this new video talk for us. Let's talk about the CER optimizer for Shopify. If you're getting started into Shopify, it's really important to talk about the CEO. And CEO actually means search engine optimization. Let's explain this a little bit more faster. If I am going to open a new tab here, what I wanted to do is to talk about a product that I'm selling or I wanted to actually sell into my store. Let's say, for example, that I'm currently snowboards. So if I type snowboards, it's going to be appearing to me the most popular websites that are currently selling uh, this product. So they have evil.com, they have boatman.com, they have backcountry.com, and you can just click into the website that has more views and you can see that they actually are selling this actual product so this is what ceo stands for if you wanted to let's say improve your ceo of your actual shopify store you're actually in the right place and if you're just getting started as a beginner you have to worry about how to use a lot of content how to use meta stuff uh, you don't need to worry about that we're going to be using a free easy tools that can be helping you just to boost a little bit more your actual store so the very first thing you want to do once you have your store ready and created in order to get started with the optimization of your actual store is to first of all check it out your products if I focus into the lip hard, it has my actual dashboard and hit into my actual products. As you can see, we have bunched up things that we are actually selling into my actual store. So what I wanted to do is to click into, let's say, for example, the first one that I'm actually selling and make sure that I have the right title and the right description for this product. In this case, as you can see, we have the videographer snowboard. So my keyword, which in my case is snowboard, comes into the title. In the description, we don't have absolutely anything. So that means we need to change this and we even have here the generate text and this can be helping you to create something much more professional easy and concrete for you so if you use only the keyword for example snowboard cool secure easy use uh tone of voice let's say go for supportive or even daring or playful i'm going to go with generate text and automatically it's going to be generating me a description that can be helping the actual uh buyer to incentivize them to actually buy the product so now just scroll a little bit down you have to make sure that you have the actual right media to upload your actual product lastly check out your search engine listing the search engine listing is how it should be appearing to your actual product the website the let's say sub page of your website of this product so it's gonna be appearing as the videographer snowboard so the meta description and the page title should be appearing like this if you're okay with that just leave it like that if you don't you can just change your characters for example only go with snowboards combine cool design and let's go conquer the mountain easy to use and you can add this for all ages Let's go men and women. So this is going to be helping Google to understand what we are selling so we can appear more into the very first part of Google. So now into the meta fields, we have snowboarding Benton Mountain. We can add something else if you wanted to or snowboard linked. For example, you can add your own dimensions if you wanted to. So that will be totally up to you. But this is how you could be helping your store to label up your CEO. And then your first task of your Shopify store is to do exactly the same thing with all your products. All the things that we have do so far, you need to do this with all your products so you can have more chances to get into the CEO, the search engine of the actual Google. The next things I want to do is to go directly into the left part to go into my actual settings. Now into the settings, we're going to do something related of what we just did with your product, but you're going to be doing this directly with your actual store. For example, this client store name is called Quick Start. So this is totally bad because we wanted to go into edit and we wanted to make sure that everybody knows we are selling snowboard. So if let's say for example my store is called milk, I can change that or I can just improve this um this store name. So for example, milk buy. So this can be helping a lot, but truly, truly a lot to appear more and more into the upper side of the Google. So now get into save, of course. And now let's go into the actual next part, which is the apps and sales channel. 
Uh, the actual sales channel of your social network should be helping us to incentivize a little bit more the CEO into your actual Shopify store. So if you haven't added your Facebook channel or your Instagram channel, you can do this directly into apps and sales channel and hit into your Facebook and Instagram. So once you install this, which is totally free, you just need to import your actual accounts and then later on you can get started by just reviewing the sales channel inside the meta business suit of both social networks which in this case now that we are talking about this actual field you can do exactly the same thing directly into google and the youtube so this sales channel can be helping you to improve a little bit more your sales directly into google for example if i go and open my new tab so i can go for snowboards once again and if i focused into shopping section you can see that we have a lot of products that we can buy from different places. So if you added your Google and YouTube sales channel and start by importing your products directly into Shopify, you should be appearing to the very first page when somebody click into snowboards or well, depending on what you're actually selling. So this can be helping you a lot to improve your CEO. And lastly, what I would be showing you, I'm gonna go back, is to add your first block into Shopify. Creating a block is gonna be helping your actual store to improve, to add value, to bring value into what you're actually selling and to bring more information to your store and into Google so they can be understanding what you're actually selling. So if you go into the left part and says online store, I'm going to click into blog post and into blog, you can get started by creating a blog post and I can get started with my very first blog. In my case, since we are selling snowboards, we can talk about, uh, try to talk about a actual field that you're actually willing to talk about to have a really really great point of view at your own content and you can add your actual search engine listing preview you can in edit your actual website ceo here for example top 10 snowboard issues in 2023 you can add your own description and the url and handle should be appearing like this and the last thing that I can recommend you into Shopify is to add your first boost of CEO. You need to find a actual plan that is totally free. For example, there is Booster CEO. This one comes with a free plan available, but only has one day free trial. So you want to make sure that you find the one that has an actual free plan, not seven day free trial, not 14 day free trial. You want to find the one that says free plan available only. So once you find the right for you, once you have checked it out that it actually has a really great ratings and great reviews, you just need to add the actual application and let the application do their actual own directly into your Shopify store. So with that being said, guys, we have now reached into the very end of the video. So you guys now know a little bit about CEO into your actual Shopify store. So hopefully this was a very great information for you. You can just check it out more information about CEO directly into our channel. Or you can let us know in the comment below if you want to let me know everything about CEO inside of Shopify and how you can improve a little bit more your actual store as you are selling more and more content. So thank you once again for watching the video guys and hopefully I can see you next time.